By the end of this video, you will be able to turn off loop in FL Studio. Let's get started. So there are a couple ways to disable the loop feature in FL Studio. The first way is, let's say you're working in your playlist window here, and let's say I start playing the song, you'll see that it will loop back to the beginning. And it will keep doing that because I currently have the loop on. So the easiest way to change this within your playlist feature is to go ahead and press Shift T on your keyboard. And so once I press Shift T, you'll notice that a little arrow was added at the top of your playlist here. And I'm going to left click that and see if I can get to it. Yeah, left click that. You'll notice it turns to a double arrow when you have it selected. So once you have it left clicked, you can move it to where you would like the piece to end. And that means that the, that the song will end there and it will not loop back to the beginning. So let's show you what that what I mean. So I have paint selected and with paint selected, I can change where the playhead goes. I'm going to go ahead and press play or the space bar on my keyboard. And now it will play, but it will stop at that end point. So you see it stopped at the point that I told it to stop. And then it returned back to the playhead where I had it set originally. So the shortcut again was shift and T at the same time. Another way to do the same thing is to press this arrow button here in your playlist and then go down to time markers and then you'll click on place loop or shift T. It's the same thing. So you see it placed it at the beginning again. So that does the exact same thing um, just without the shortcut. So this is just one tutorial, but think about how much better your tracks could be with the right tools. I've created the FL Studio Pro Producer Pack, a free resource filled with the best sample sources, plugins, and templates to help you level up your music production game. So click the link in the description to grab it for free. Another reason that you might have it looped here is let's say you were in selector mode. And so selector mode is this icon right there. And let's say I had a selection here and it turns red when you have a selection. When I press play, you notice it keeps looping that selection and that's by design. So if you wanted to stop looping this section, what you need to do is click selector mode and then click outside of the selection. And one thing that you might be having problems with too is between selector mode and paint mode. So selector mode is where you can select things and let's say you and then go to paint mode. It will not let you get rid of the selection. So again, you need to be in selector mode and then just left click outside of the area in this, uh, you know, by the measure numbers, and then that will get rid of the selection. And one other setting you might want to check for looping is on the top of your screen, this section here, this is mostly for when you're recording, but you might have that enabled. So if you want to, you know, disable a uh, looping when you're recording, you want to just click that button there and it will turn that off. So that might be another area where you want to stop the looping from happening. So you now know how to disable looping in FL Studio. If you made it this far into the video, you might also be interested in how to create a fade out for your song. I made another video that covers this and I'll put a link to that video here.